Hey there everyone and welcome back to another video here with FMI Gaming. I am Levi and uh, today I got something special. My new keyboard came in and it's a stop or stop. Um, but I'm not going to stop anymore. I've been waiting to open this up for a while because I was trying to get my, my software set up correctly so I could record my new program I was going to use because I'm currently still using the Logitech webcam software which is a piece of crap because like the audio and the video gets off sync for some reason and it doesn't like to save it at a constant frame rate so everything is gets all shitty but the other programs I was looking into do the same thing so yay I still haven't found a good thing to record my webcam with um, I was gonna use XSplit which does webcam and video or uh, end game but that audio does not work in Premiere Pro without doing a whole bunch of tricks which messes it up as well so we're just gonna open this up uh, I just got this today um, go figure and I'm gonna be really stupid and cut towards myself with this knife and it's like a dull knife not a very good knife and I'm gonna slice oh, hopefully I don't cut myself right here ah uh, scare I know you guys can't see much uh, maybe I'll tilt it down a little bit more Hey, like that. Let me see my nice shirt. So this is right here. I oh, you still can't see it like worth crap. Now I know that. And I'm tilting my monitor down so you can see, not anything else. So I'm just gonna pull it out here. It is a DOS keyboard, um, which is a nice keyboard brand, and it is a professional, non-silent one with Cherry MX Blues, and I know most of you probably have no clue what Cherry MX Blues are, um, and I don't blame you, but they're mechanical switches that make a loud click. Oh, I got like random advertisements in case I want, you know, a diamond dependent for my daughter, because they have to give old men who are obsessed with gaming reminders that they have daughters to buy stuff for. Um, that is kind of a cheap shot, I believe. Because you're spending so much money on a keyboard, they figure you can spend money on your daughter as well. Stop. Before opening your product, read the following instructions. What? Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah. Return, return, returns, returns, and... Um, okay, cool. Not really read that. That was a lie. Oh, and look at that. In case in case you're just forever alone, they give you an advertisement to order bottles of wine. Discover 12 Mighty Reds. Save $110 today. Damn, that's a good idea. I I might need that in a couple days here. And then got my shipping or my invoice thing. So I'll take that off now and let's see here. Let's open this up. It's got a flap right there. Da -da 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 I'm excited. Hopefully this webcam recording works right. So you guys can see this. Okay, this comes up and then that comes in. Okay. Oh, and it unfolds like that. Which way's up? Which way's up? This way's up. This way is up. Because it folds away from you. That makes sense. Oh, I'll go down even further. You probably still can't see much. And, oh, my mic is actually in the way. Let's hopefully not break everything by moving this. My desk is a mess. My Dr. Pepper cup is just chilling there. And that's as far as down as my monitor can tilt. So you're going to have to put up with it. Um, so I'm not moving it. So we're just going to pull this out real quick. And, oh, mm, there's the cord. Nice. So this keyboard um, features a... No key rollover when you um, when you install it through your PS2 serial port, um, and that's a good thing. That means that like when you're hitting down multiple buttons, hitting down multiple buttons, and you hit another one, this one would actuate as well. But on other keyboards, you'd hit a few, and then anything else you push wouldn't get actuated. So this one, you can push on every button and then hit the last one, and it'll still hit that last one, which is really cool. So there it is. It's nice and dossy and oh it even has a cleaning cloth so you can clean the glossy um, stuff here so let's take off this wrap and maybe undo the cord first get out of the way a little bit and ooh, ooh. I don't know what to do with my old keyboard um, I might send it or get Razor to send me a new one because this one's defective as is um, 
but then I would have two keyboards, which I don't need one. I'm considering giving one away. Um, so guys, let me know if it's something you're cons you're, you're interested in, me giving that away. See, it comes with a little adapter for the PS2. So you get two USB things, but then you get one, an adapter that goes over it. So this is what you want to plug in, because this will have the no key rollover. Whereas if you do USB, you have like eight or something like that. Not that I really cared, because I'm not going to use it. Now I'm going to plug it in, and hopefully it won't break everything. It probably will. Um, well, I should probably close my knife before I cut myself. Uh, I'm going to move my computer so I can get to my stuff. Oh, my computer's over here on this side. And it's heavy, and it's shoved between the desk and the wall, so it's hard to get to anything. Now I'm going to get out of here and hopefully not cut my head off. Hello, Mr. Ports. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, where does it go? That's that one. Okay. It goes on that side, I believe. Hopefully that goes in. I can't really see much over here. So that might be a problem. Might be a slight little problem. So I'm going to pull out further. Hopefully not break anything. Okay, so that does go like that. I'm sure it's the right part. It is. Definitely the right one. Uh, maybe I'll take out these other ones. And my... Yeah, it's still recording good. I unplugged my other keyboard, which I had in a strategic location, so I could easily access it because I'd have to unplug it and plug it back in because it sucked and it would freeze up and stuff. Is that plugged in? Okay, let's take this off. And then let's see, how do I, how, what should I do to test this? Let's see, open this up. Okay, it's not, it's not in yet. <sighs> Does that have to be work them? I don't think so. Maybe I should have, like, read a manual or something. No, I don't think they can give you one, though. Because, I mean, it's, it's a keyboard. You just plug it in. Yep, that's no nothing, nothing helpful. Hello, box. Oh, DOS keyboard. Oh, instructions just didn't come out. Installation does not require any driver and should be recognized immediately by Windows. Okay, you're, so you're supposed to... Well, one, turn off your computer, and two, put in both um, USBs. Ah! Come on. I know you can do it. Yeah? It's doing something. It's accessing my external hard drive? Why? So you hear, you hear the clicks, but it's still not doing anything. Okay. Let's, let's try it with just two USBs. So it's the other USB, and I'm getting that bloop bloop sound. Yes, yeah, so that's the noise you're going to hear now. I can type now. Yay. Yay, it's so much fun. Okay, now can I get the PS2 adapter to work? Let's see. Let's click this, make sure we don't fry anything. Yeah, I don't think, don't think I have to do that. Like that, take that out. Put that in. Get it all lined up. Uh, is, it, is it in or? It's not in. Okay, so this, I don't know how this thing is not working well. Uh oh. Like, it feels like it's not going in all the way, but I can't really tell because I have no light down here. 
And yes, it apparently it takes me 10 minutes to install a keyboard. Hello, Mr. Adapter. Uh, I think I think you might have to re actually restart your computer for the PS2 jack. So I'm gonna do that. All right, guys. Um, I will give you results of how much I like this keyboard. Probably in every single one of my videos for a while because that's typically how I do things. Um, I'm excited and it makes noise and stuff. And it's super responsive. It's nice. It's nice. All right, guys. I'll see you next time. Um, Stay tuned for more videos as my camera goes in and out of focus. Um, yeah, let me know if you are interested in me giving away my other keyboard or the replacement keyboard maybe. Um, let me know if you guys have any experience with mechanical keyboards. You probably you guys probably had the dome top keyboards and um, stuff. Those don't make much noise. Well, most keyboards don't make noise. It's just these MX Blues that make noise really. Um, but yes, I'll see you guys next time. Um, yeah, I love you. Bye.